Welcome to Miniorange. Miniorange's Jira user provisioning products are the most successful on the Atlassian market. So, in this video, we'll show you how to use Azure AD as a provider to allow skin provisioning in Jira. Go to the Jira dashboard. Click on setting icon on the top right corner, and select Manage Apps option. Go to Search tab and search Skim. To download the plugin click on Free Trial. Click on Accept and Install to agree with Miniorange policy and terms of use. After successful installation use the license key to activate and a plugin. Your plugin has been installed successfully. You can view plugin settings using any of the ways. The first way is to click on Plugin. Then click on Configure. Then either way is Navigate to User Management and click on Miniorange User Sync. In the Configuration tab select Azure Active Directory as an IDP. We will be covering the skim setup here. You can also go through the setup guide by clicking on Documentation. Select your IDP, you will get step-by-step -step instructions here. Now enter the app name of your choice. Skim base URL and bearer token creates an inner relationship between Jira and Azure AD. We will require skim base URL and bearer token for further configuration. Then click on to save settings. Now click on provisioning operations and enable all operations. Import users, update Jira users, import users IDP groups, enable Jira users. Disable Jira users, then click on Save Settings. Here plugin setting has been saved successfully. If you face any issue related to the plugin then check the Troubleshooting tab. Here you can download the log file as well as support zip files. Let us check user management in Jira without skim. Go back to the Miniorange plugin in Jira. Click on Setting. Then click on User Management. As we can see, no user has been added. Let's set up Azure AD Skim Configuration. Log in to Azure Active Directory account. After login click on Azure Active Directory. Then click on to Enterprise Application. And select New Application. Then create own application. And type application name here. Then click on Create. Your application has been added successfully. Select Provisioning and Left Menu. Click on Get Started. Select Automatic and Provisioning Mode. For Terrent URL go to Miniorange User Sync Plugin. Then click on Edit. Copy the Skimp Base URL from the plugin. And paste it in the Tenant URL in the application. Copy the bearer token from the plugin. And paste it in the secret token in the application. Then click on Test Connection to verify connection. Your connection has been tested successfully. Then click on Save. Then go back to Enterprise Application and select Users and Groups. And click on Add Users or Groups. And click on Not Selected. Then select User. Click on Select, then click on Assign. Your application assignment succeeded. User has been assigned successfully, then go to Provisioning tab. Click on Start Provisioning. Your provisioning is scheduled to start. Navigate to View Provisioning Details. As we can see the user provisioning cycle runs after 40 minutes that means you can verify user management with Jira. Let us check the user management in Jira with Skim. Go to Jira Dashboard. Click on Setting. Then click on User Management. As we can see the data of the Azure AD user has been synced successfully with Jira. Let us update existing user profile in Azure AD to check the user provisioning in Jira. Then go back to your Azure AD account. And click on the user. Then click on Edit and change the user credentials. 
Then click on save. User has been updated successfully. Then go back to your mini range plugin. Then click on user profile. As we can see, the updated data of the user has been synced successfully with Jira. Manyrange provides best user provisioning solutions. Thanks for watching.